All right, hello and welcome back. Uh, so, Jin and the party were finally able to track down the um, Rakshasa that was being hunted by a group of uh, Dao genies camped on the outskirts of Trade Meet, uh, which meant that the uh, genies finally left the town alone and lifted their uh, economic blockade on the, uh, on the trading town, uh, which means that Trade Meet is finally open for business uh, which means Jin can have a look at it wares, um, and as uh, and of course in gratitude, the mayor um, offered a fairly large reward. I think it's about ten thousand gold. Um, yeah, so the party has almost fifty thousand gold now. Uh, so the, they were given a fairly large reward, and also uh, were approached by two nobles um, based in the town. The uh, forget their family um, names, but. Uh, we'll go to them. It's a fairly complicated name, so you don't know how to pronounce it. Check it out on the map in a moment. Uh, before we leave, just Consider wanted to speak to the guild mistress. Have you been successful? Yeah, I found the Rakshas that the Dao were looking for, and they've agreed to leave. Ah, so it is done. And you've found a peaceful solution as well. That means we do not have to fear a visit by more of their kind. Their good reputation is well deserved, I think. You have the sincere thanks of Trade Meat's merchants, and I am sure all of its citizens. Here is the reward that I promised you. I myself have much to do at the moment. The caravans must be contacted and brought in immediately to give us the supplies we need. Thank you once again. Oh wow, okay. I've gained uh, five items, I think. And, uh, oh, uh, 7,500 gold, that's uh, fairly generous. Oh, I think um, we're given probably these gems and maybe a sword. Oh, I know this is um, from the Dao Genie. Okay, yeah, Rashad's Talon. So I'm guessing it's these five items. Shield of Harmony. Uh, immunity to Charm, Confusion, Domination, Hold Person. All class bonus three. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, Chihira had a... Yeah, nobody in the party really uses shields. Um, I guess Chihira is the one who might consider it. Let me put that in the bag. Uh, I think these are just... Yeah. To start standard jewelry. It said that I think the rogue stone was what enabled the party to access the um, access the twisted rune. So what I might do then is actually keep one rune stone in case we come across any more. Um, <laughs> although uh, I don't think uh, without specifically looking for it. I'm not sure how we can find them. Uh, okay. Put that in there. Right. So yeah, yes. um, both the uh, noble families you seem kind of dubious. Um, certainly rather arrogant and aloof in their attitude. What were they called? And uh, they're uh, fiercely, uh, they're fierce rivals, so we can only really um, help with one of them. So this is where the room went to the Laraxo estate, and there's the Ali Bakar estate. Uh, <laughs> it's really difficult. I think um, we will go to the Ali Bakar estate first. But one reason to get closer. Another one is because the Ali Bar Lord Ali Balkar said very clearly that uh, if we work for the Laruxo estate, uh, these doors will no longer be uh, welcome. So, whereas uh, the Larux, uh, I don't know what her exact title is, but the uh, lady from the uh, House of Laraxo did not make such an obvious um, demand. 
Well, I guess we're not really expecting to fight, so... These are all guardsmen. Okay. Where's the Lord then? Is that him? Okay, Lord Skarman Ali Bakar. What do you want? Not touch me. Speak and be done with it. Hello, hello once again, Samajin. It is pleasing to see that you did not respond to the call of that harlot, Lady Lilith. The woman is too deluded to see the truth. As I said, a commoner that has risen above her station. Yeah, his attitude really um annoys Jen. Our two houses have been feuding for generations. The, R the Ruxos seem to be possessed of the notion that their family founded this town. What an absurd thought. Why they would even presume to suppose such a thing, I have no idea. It is sad, however, that the Ali Bakars have never had the evidence to prove our claim to them, though it gores me that we would need it. All that has changed, has recently changed. An old tome belonging to my family states there is proof. That proof can be found right here in Trade Meet. Ah, okay. In the graveyard there is a tomb that has been long abandoned, but which also houses the founder of the town, my ancestor. With him lies a large circlet called the Mantle of Joaquin. Possessing that circlet would be all the proof I need, so I wish to acquire it. I would do it myself, but there happens to be a good reason the tomb is abandoned. It is uh, haunted, so they say. The exact nature of the, its danger I do not know. But you are a hero who surely could face its perils as if you return with a mantle, yes? In return, I shall pay you a thousand gold. That's a pretty shit reward. At this stage, um. No, I think a large reward is required here. Hmm, I'm sure there is treasure to be found in the tomb if you look for it. And if you're thinking of going to the Luraxel Witch, I doubt she can pay more. No, a thousand is all I offer. Still not sure about desecrating the tomb and the buried dead, however. Don't be squeamish, Jin. You have done this before, no? And besides, the haunted tomb is long me a nuisance. I'm sure the town will look on this as yet another feat of your heroism. Uh, I think Jim will press the uh, negotiations. I think a larger payment is necessary. Okay. Alright, then I'll retrieve this mantle for you. Very good. I shall give you the key then, which will allow you into the tomb. The key itself has been being in my family for some time. Uh, for some time as well. No proof, yes? Go then and return with the mantle. Jane is kind of hoping that, uh, I should have read the journal, uh, Lady Laraxo would still speak with him. I prefer to uh, get to the bottom of what's actually going on, because he really doesn't like Anibalka's attitude. Um, yeah, during the reward ceremony held for me by Lord Logan, both Lady Laraxo and Lord Anibalka approached me separately. Offering me employment and warning against the other. If I'm interested, I should go to see one of them at their estate. Lord Logan warned me afterwards of their feuding, saying I should stay clear of them for my own good. Okay. <laughs> um, the way to enter a tomb contains a golden circlet named the Mantle of Joaquin, which will prove the Lord Scarman's claim to his family being the only true nobility in the town. Okay. I don't think Jin is particularly afraid of yes. ghosts. In fact, I think he would regard uh, an undead presence in the town as an opportunity to rid the world of a bit more evil. Um, that said, we would like to uh, maybe hear out maybe Laraxo's side of the story. Wondering if uh, she would be offended that we're going to see Lord. Uh, Oh, damn neighbor. Um... Skarman? Ali Barker, anyway. Yeah. 
Okay, I'm guessing this is the Laraxo guards. What is my as you ask? Nice kitchen. Don't assume uh, she be in there. There's a bedroom, where is she? Okay. I wonder if uh, she's gone because we've already seen uh, Lord Ali Barker. Hmm. May the gods look upon you kindly. Ah, okay. Dig on, dog. We know fool you work for that, for the Ali Barkar. So take your presence away from my lady's house. It's a bit annoying. I think um, I think could choose if you probably prefer to work with uh, Lady Larazzo. It shall be. Okay. Well, we're not gonna storm uh, potentially uh, undead infested crypts um, without getting some rest first. So returning to. I was going to say returning to the pub, but it's uh, daytime. We might as well visit the market. Um, see what wares are available now in trade meet. I think there's quite a lot of merchants along along this uh, this road, I guess. Okay, a little girl to rice or ise. Nice. My my mother and father were killed by wolves. They were. I've got to go to the orphanage. They say. Oh, okay. This is tragic, child. Oh, that is tragic, child. Here, take these coins. Perhaps it will help. Thank you, sir. But I'm not here to beg. I'm just waiting for the priest to come and take me to the orphanage. But thank you anyway. Okay. It's a bit of good deed, given how rich we are. Right. Oh, he's uh, got some <laughs> very basic equipment. It's kind of disappointing. All right, never mind. Yes. This looks like a door. Right, let's see what Wallace has. Hello, friend. Can you see my wares? Yes, that's why we're here. Um, prices are reasonable. Why would I buy an emerald? Oh, okay, scroll case. That's good. I think that means uh, now all the uh, arcane passes have a um, scroll case each. Um, parity is. Not very useful. Hmm. What's this? Oh, he's a healer as well. Interesting. On my arm. So far, the uh, wares of trade me have been a bit disappointing. I see this merchant has. Okay, let's see your services. Okay, it's this club plus three. Plus three and plus three acid. Hmm. Uh, potentially, I guess the hero could use this. Golden floor, warhammer that does extra damage to giants and ogres. Don't really think of physical enemies like that as being particularly dangerous anymore, so don't think we need that. Okay, this guy seems to <laughs> have the fancy stuff. Alright, it's a bow that requires no ammunition. Plus three, it's a short bow, which means anyone could use it. Um, and a 
Let's see what else is called. The martial stamp. Stamp of striking. So this is basically a quarter stamp plus three. Um, some sort of sword. The ancient sword can attack on its own for four rounds. Hmm. Oh, okay, he has ammunition. Um, she buys some arrows actually. Let's buy. Oh, he's only got that much, so buy all of them. Wow, the arrows are piercing and expensive. Didn't realize how expensive they were. Okay. Uh, bullets by some. Um, yeah, I think that would be. Should be able to pick up more. Wow, this is definitely the guy with the uh, fancy equipment. Um, cloak of displacement. Okay, so improved saving throws. And, wait, my reading is right. Armor class plus four. Or oh, versus missile weapons. <laughs> Otherwise, that would be absolutely crazy. Um, you can still, I mean, this is a good cloak. Protection means missile weapons, improved saving throws, which I think is pretty useful. Uh, okay, what else? Belt of inertial barrier. Plus 5 versus breath. 25% resistance to missile damage. Um, Whoa, plus fifty percent resistance to magic damage. That's pretty amazing. Uh, yeah, okay. Well, we can afford both of them actually. Um, and given this is trade news. We're not going to try and rip off the merchant with our friends. Any issues do we have? I don't think everyone even has a belt, so we'll buy this one for sure. Cloak, um, I'm going to have a look at what everyone has right now and see if we actually need it. Cloak of reflection, I don't think I've ever used this. Oh, it's electricity. Um, Nazi won't be around that much. Uh, this is basically a cloak of protection plus one. So yes. I never use the uh, full ability. It's a plus two. Um, given how much spells Ari has now, I don't think we'll really use that very much. Nature servant awaits. And yeah. Yeah, I'll buy it. It's not that expensive. What is my task? It shall be. Okay, cloak displacement. And who would benefit the most from that? I'm attempting to give it to Chin. General Minsk, one of the two. Uh, Yeah, Eri has a staff protection. I think Jin's armor class, even with spirit armor, is kind of bad, so... Um... Yeah. Try to cloak himself. And that's not a very good cloak. Goes in the bag. Whoa. <laughs> that's... Kind of, uh... 
Guess he's gonna be permanently in that thing. Okay. Uh, anything else? The nearest house? I think that's where the merchants. Any more? Alright, farm animals. Militia soldier. Okay, I think we'll head to the smithy. See if he has anything new. Well, I should see if he has anything now. Pretty sure he didn't have anything last time we visited. Hopefully that cloak would uh is actually um yeah, hopefully that would uh <laughs> reduce the number of times um Jim dies because of a random death spell that he loses a saving a saving for against. On my arm. Yes. Well, you look like the sort of have two gold pieces to rub together. Nothing's jumping out at me. Okay, he's also got arrows and bullets and potions. Strength 21. This kind of thing, now that we have a potion case, is actually kind of useful, I think, for Jin. In a difficult battle. Oh, okay, he's also got scrolls. Protection from cold. No, I don't think Jansen has that. Okay, we'll buy the potion and one scroll. Tet illusion. Um, I think we we'll have that. Fire shield. Protection from normal weapons. Lower, lower resistance. I think we need that. Uh, Ah, robe of the good arch magic. Alright, he's got quite a lot of stuff. <laughs> uh, nah, I may not be able to afford everything I want. Okay. Yeah, because I think Emily doesn't have anything, does she? Yep. Yeah, just a robe of, um, cold resistance. To check her. She is good, so she would be, uh, I think she would benefit from that. Uh, robe. Mary obviously has a robe of that. No. Jin doesn't have anything actually. Um, does he have any Mary? elven chain? Just so that Jin like can be wearing something. To rub together. Nope, doesn't look like it. Um, Alright, we'll buy this for Imowen. Gives us with 9,000 gold and uh, uh, you know what? I'm gonna go back to the inn yes. and uh, Done. rest up before we head towards the uh, crypt. And also, uh, in between this session and the next, I'm gonna <laughs> look at my uh, spell list because I don't remember it off the top of my head. And uh, check if um, I want to buy any of the scrolls at the smithy. Didn't expect to find scrolls at the smithy. Uh, Alright, back to the pub. Guessing this is the uh, only tavern type building in the town. No idea who Tyrus is. Okay. It shall be. I'll test your metal with cold steel. Whoa, whoa, whoa. The Raxel Guard and Alibaka guards are fighting it out in the in the uh, pub. Well, I don't think that Jimmy bother intervening. What is my task? Although I think if the um the Raxel Guard wins. Ah, that shows him. The Raxels are, are the only true noble family in trade meet and should be respected as such. Me. Speak and be done with it. Okay, uh, I suppose this had to happen. Now that things have been restored to normal, the feud begins once more. Those two families have nothing, uh, have been nothing but problems in this town. I'm surprised Lord Logan doesn't order their death. 
They certainly are asking for it. If scenes like this continues, tension everyone, there will be no further brawling in this area or any involved will be arrested. You all know how the Laraxo and Ali Bakars can be, yes? Don't get involved, I warn you. Lord Logan will be informed of this incident immediately. Calm down and return to your business at once. Well, Jim wasn't really planning to get involved anyway. On my honor. Consider so the guard done. has nothing. Okay. Actually, yeah, should probably have done this before. Uh, probably should have asked her out of town before Jin agreed to work for the Alibar cars. What can you tell me about the feud between the Laraxos and the Alibar cars? Ah, both of those families are fools, <laughs> rich fools. Nobody but them really cares which is the true family family. And if Lord, Go Lord Logan is correct, they stem from the same family anyway. <laughs> Alright. But they'll never believe that. Their relations and guards have been battling for many years, sometimes to open violence. One of these days they will take it too far. What's the story in this haunted tomb? Hmm, now that's a good question. The tomb in our graveyard has been abandoned for many, many years. The stories say that an evil wizard was locked in there while he was alive, and there he died. The tomb waited months to reopen the town waited months to reopen the tomb. When they did, the corpse of the wizard vowed revenge and tried to escape. The priest of Joaquin turned him within and was resealed the tomb, and so it has remained. Personally, I give the stories short shrift. There's never been as much as a peep from that tomb, but it's a small thing within, I am told. And it is a small thing within, I am told. But you would not find me venturing within, that's for sure, eh? Alright, okay. Almost sounds like they might find a leech in there. I'm pretty sure a leech is a undead, long lived wizard or something. Um, let's see your services. Okay. Uh, actually, just want to check if we're okay with um, spells. Yeah, I don't expect to find vampire. Then again, we're about to go to a crypt, so we'll keep that. Okay. That will do. Help, however, faster than take, take a fast pause. What do you hmm? are not mercenaries, are you? I right. ate those money. Resting up. Scum. And uh, next time we'll be heading to the crypt to uh, try to, I think, recover yes. a circlet <laughs> that's supposed to prove the um, Alibarkas of the true noble family. But I think Jin is just more curious to see what's inside the crypt and uh, maybe find some um, items of power. Alright, thank you, Nancy. Alright, okay, I'll see you next time.